And that breaking news, crews are still searching for a missing swimmer in Kenosha County. A man went under in Center Lake in the town of Salem this afternoon. And that's where we find our Cody Holyoke, who spoke with a friend of the victim. Cody. Mike Carroll, good evening, and we are here on the shore of Center Lake in the town of Salem, where, as you said, the search is continuing. You can see behind me a boat equipped with high-tech sonar is still looking for the body of 75-year-old Clyde Rudeau. His family is not far from here. They are understandably exhausted after hours of searching so far has yet to provide any sense of closure. For years, many years, this has been a very safe lake. Simply put, neighbors in the small town of Salem are stunned, stranded at the shoreline while dive crews search for their friend. The wind was stronger earlier today. Deputies tell a 75-year-old Clyde Rutho took his boat out on the lake to cool off. A day in the sun transformed into tragedy. I was out swimming with his daughter and with a friend and uh, they had been swimming. He decided to enter the water, go for a swim, and after uh, several minutes of swimming, he just went underwater. First responders flocked to Center Link. Rutho's family lent the man's pontoon boat as a staging area for divers. But after two hours, the search became a recovery mission. We just realized that we're not going to be able to, to find the victim. Certainly difficult for his family. was right there with him and tried to help him and find him initially. Nice man. He'd give you the shirt off of his back. The news is especially hard for people like Lori Volbrecht, who knew Rutho for nearly a decade. She tells me the man had severe Parkinson's and wonders why her friend went swimming in the first place. Just wondering how it happened, period. If, he, you know, from his Parkinson's, he got really shaky and sometimes he had a hard time keeping his balance. It doesn't sound like for this family to do. It just ended tragically today. Right now, I'm told dive crews have found something in the water. They are investigating that right now, but we do not know if it is the body of Clyde Rudeau. The search, if this doesn't yield any results, will be wrapping up tonight. Dive crews and sonar teams will be back here in the morning to resume their search. Reporting live in Kenosha County, Cody Holyoke, today's TMJ4. Tough day for that community. Cody, thank you very much.